I am on day 1271. Welcome to another OMAD vlog. I'm Dr. Erica and I have lost and kept off 60 pounds for over three years through intermittent fasting and also through exercise. I also like to help encourage and motivate you while you're on your journey. If that sounds like something you're interested in, sis, go ahead and click the subscribe button and join the family. I promise you'll love it here. Today is Thursday, January the 4th and I am ready to have an amazing day. Today I am on day 12. 71, 1271 days in a row of me, your girl, showing up for herself every single day because see, I made myself a priority. I am definitely important and self-care is not selfish. It's actually necessary. Now, I know it is someone out there that is ready to go and start on their health and wellness journey. So if I'm talking to you, I need you to do one thing because see, it's time for you to start showing up and showing out. Not only am I the queen of consistency, I'm also the queen of walking in place. So go ahead, stand up, start walking in place watch this entire vlog and guess what your workout your exercise your movement for day one is done congratulations on making today this day your day one on the start of your health and wellness journey girl now you just got to keep going it's time for me to head downstairs and get my workout in y'all come on So I just got done working out and as always, girl, you know it was a good one, but you already know what time it is. It's time for you to check in with your accountability partner. So go ahead, tell me about your workout. I want to know what time you're working out. I want to know what kind of workout you're doing. I want to know um, how long you're going to work out for, girl. What are you watching? What are you listening to? I want to know, girl, are you doing cardio? Are you doing strength training? Tell me whatever there is to know about your workout because that's what accountability partners do. We check in, we share information. So just like I said, girl, mine was really good. You will never hear me say I had a bad workout, okay? And I probably won't hear you uh, say you had a bad workout either. I mean, because who would say that? So um, mine was really good. So as you can see, I just started out my usual. I used my cordless jump ropes. I only did 10 minutes, okay, to warm up. And then as you can see, um, I got on my elliptical this morning, but we'll get back to that in just a second. So, you know, I've been on, you know, my run game, girl, for like the past two or three weeks but this morning I did decide to get on my elliptical for an hour and then for my resistance training I just picked up those five pound um dumbbells and you know just did some upper body exercises with those and then I just ended with my cool down and stretch so what was I watching so I was watching my motivational videos um as always and then I honestly girl I was on here watching like some Amazon hauls Amazon finds you know things like that girl just 
uh, house stuff. I was looking at um, clothes. So yeah, today was an Amazon day. So back to the motivational videos. I know um, I received a couple of comments about, you know, what kind of motivational videos I um, watch. And y'all, yeah, honestly, I watch like different sermons. Girl, I love Eric Thomas. I watch Joel Osteen. I watch, you know, Steve Harvey. Girl, I, I watch, girl, Tears, um, Seville Fort. I, but I think what I'm going to do is, um, and I've been asked this girl if I can figure it out, just start linking it down in the description box. So whatever motivational video I watch for the day, try to start linking those in the description box. But girl, bear with me, okay? I got to figure that part out, okay? So um, yeah, that was my workout. And just to note, girl, my sleep score was an 86, but it's a reason for that. So y'all already know, girl, I spoke on Tuesday about, you know, that being my first day back in the office. And you already know, if you remember, girl, that I was on the struggle bus all day long on Tuesday. Then yesterday, you know, the day started out just like so amazing. But then, you know, as the day went on, you know, my husband, I was taking care of him or seeing about him, concerned about him because he hasn't been feeling well. And then remember, Braylon called me on the way home saying he had like this terrible headache. So by the time I got home, girl, I was just like, oh my gosh, you know, we are struggling again, but we pressed through. So um, remember yesterday on the midday check-in when I was saying, you know, that I felt like a little, you know, girl, like a little ting, you know, in my right knee. And so I was thinking that yesterday, um, once I got home, I would be able to, you know, kind of baby it, you know, ice it and all the things. Well, the reason why is because just the things that I just missed, you, I mean, mentioned just being a mama girl, being a wife, doing all the things. And so, you know, putting others before myself, you know, I did not get the opportunity to take care of the knee. So that's why I made the, the decision this morning to just give it a little rest, you know, because you already know, just like I said, I've been running for the past like two or three weeks. And I said, you know what? Listen to your body, girl. Okay. So I did not run this morning. I decided to go with my lower impact um, choice. And that's always my elliptical. Now I must say as the afternoon went on yesterday, my knee was feeling fine. You know, I didn't feel it, but girl, I didn't want to take any chances. Okay. I'm just like, no, you know what? You, you Girl, just, just give it a rest for just a minute. Okay. So we'll see. We might be back on the elliptical for just a day or two or three. Okay. We'll just see. We're going to play it by ear. Listen to my body. Okay. So, um, yeah, girl, listen, you already know what time it is. I'm about to head upstairs. I'm about to go ahead, start drinking on this water, trying to get a head start on this gallon. And then it's going to be time for me to go ahead and get out of here to work. So we'll just be checking in real soon. Go ahead. Let me know about your workout, best friend, girl. I'll just see you in a little while. Hey girl, it is time for our midday check-in. Best friend, go ahead, girl, check in. Let me know how your morning's going. You already know some of the things I want to know. Tell me how you're doing with your water. Girl, if you are behind, please go ahead and take a couple of sips right now, okay? Whatever your water goal is. And then how are you doing with your steps? And like I always say, girl, you can just stand up, start walking in place to try to catch up because you already know that's exactly what I do. And then if you are fasting, girl, how is your fast going? Oh yeah, and I haven't mentioned this in a couple of days. So if you want to fast with your best friend, girl, with the community, we are on the Life app. Just check it out. It'll be linked down in the description box, okay, girl? Because it's just one big party, okay? So if you are fasting, let me know how your fast is going, girl. Have you been feeling hungry at all? Is your water keeping you full? Um, how long you gonna fast for? And then if you are about to break your fast, girl, drop it in the comments, whatever you'll be eating, because you never do know who may get a meal idea from what you are eating. Just tell me anything there is to know about how your morning is going. So my morning is actually going good, sis. So as far as my water, girl, I am doing, I want to say I'm doing really good. So I'm about halfway done almost halfway done with my water okay because remember i already had my 20 ounces um starting out this morning so but we still, so we're probably gonna be a little over a gallon for today because this will be completed and just to note girl if you do hear something in the background girl i got a little helper with me today girl by the name of braylon and guess who's been trying to keep me on track with my water uh-huh y'all's nephew braylon he been like mama what are you doing you supposed to be here you supposed to be here so y'all's nephew has definitely been trying to keep me 
on track, girl, okay? And then as far as my steps, I am just over 13,000 steps. So, of course, that's like a little less than what I've been doing like the past couple of weeks. But remember, that's because I got on my elliptical this morning. So, you know, them steps didn't add up as quickly, you know. Um, And then, girl, how is my fast going? So, right now, it is about 1230. So, that means I am a little over 16 hours fasted. But I'm feeling really good. Like, not hungry, you know, at all. Because once again, girl, I honestly feel like I keep on saying it these past couple of videos that the water, um, increasing my water has definitely, you know, done the trick. So I'm actually doing good. And in fact, I've been sitting here responding to a few comments, girl. I actually have been considering, girl. I can't make any promises, but I'm just like, do I need to go ahead and maybe make today a down day and then have an update tomorrow? Because yes, this will be your girl's last day in the office for the week. I don't have hospital tomorrow or anything like that so i'm thinking hmm if I do a down day on today, then, you know, I would be able to just get out tomorrow, enjoy the day, you know, break a little faster. So once again, girl, I'm not making any promises. We're going to see how I'm feeling a little later on and that will determine. But you just got to keep on watching to see, you know, what time I'm going to break my fast, you know, like what I'll be eating and then what I've decided. So just overall, just having a way better day than what I have had these past two days. Because remember, like I said, girl, Tuesday was on the struggle bus. Yesterday had a lot of things going on on with the family so and just to note Braylon's headache girl was feeling much better once he took that medicine on last night so how has my morning been though girl when I tell you your sis been over here quite busy so although the children are back officially at school although Braylon is not in school you know because he's on a different school system the children around here are back at school um but we've still been quite busy so uh yeah but I'm not complaining I'll definitely take it what else did I need to update you on so so, oh yeah, so how is this knee doing? You know what, girl, knee is doing good, okay? So we just still gonna be taking it kind of easy because remember I was mentioning yesterday, girl, how I was feeling this knee a little bit, okay, from all that running. But by getting on the elliptical this morning, you know, the my knee feels back to normal, but I may, we'll see. We'll make that decision when we come, um, when I wake up in the morning, girl, on what I'm actually gonna do as far as my workout. Do I give it like another day or two, you know, and just stick with something low impact or will I be back on my running, girl? I have no idea so um yeah i'm gonna sit here catch up on some charts okay girl probably spend a little bit of time with Raylan because of course i've been back and forth seeing the patients you know girl just show me little boy some attention okay because he be wanting to play the games and show me things on his phone um let's see what else now he does have basketball practice later on oh yeah and you know what something else i forgot to mention okay girl we got the first official basketball game um on this weekend so that's something else y'all can be looking forward to okay girl i'm gonna stop rambling okay so yeah sis go ahead check in of course i hope you are having the most amazing day so far as always girl you gotta let me know how your morning's going but i'm about to sit here catch up on some charts because you know i haven't been writing up any charts okay because we've been so busy and then catch up on this water too because if not y'all already know your nephew gonna be keeping me uh in check so check in let me know how you're doing we'll just catch up a little later on once i get home and then i'll just be letting you know if today is going to be my like my alternate day fasting modified alternate day or just my regular old man all right girl we'll be checking in real soon here is my one meal for today. So for tonight, I will be having my vegan meatballs, my steamable bag of green beans, and then my potato, which girl, you already know, I just put that in the air fryer. Tonight, it was on 370 for 18 minutes with a side of ketchup, of course. And then I'm going in with my beans. Now, this is the first time I'll be trying this. So um, y'all already know I usually be um, eating my black beans, but tonight it's gonna be these mixed chili beans. So I just seasoned that up. I, um, this is what I added in there. This better than bouillon. Um, it's the vegetable, um, vegetable um, base. And that's kind of what I use. So I'm ready to go ahead, eat my food. Now, I will say now, while I was getting all of this together, I did break my fast with two bananas. Okay, because your girl didn't want to wait for all this food to get done. So I've already had two bananas. And now I'm about to go ahead and finish my one meal for today. So it's about 7.30 and I just got done eating. And girl, you already know what I'm going to say. Yes, my meal, my one meal for today was definitely a 10 out of 10. So those mixed chili beans, 
girl. Okay, yeah, those are really good, you know. So um, I'll definitely be, you know, repurchasing those and, you know, maybe add them into the rotation. And then, of course, I mean, y'all done already seen everything else a million times before on the channel, like the green beans, the potatoes, you know, my vegan meatballs. So, um, yeah, I'm feeling really satisfied. So it's time to go back into my fast. And, of course, we'll just do it all over again, you know, for tomorrow. So, no, girl, it wasn't going to be no alternate day fasting or not a modified alternate day fast today. So as you can see, I just decided to go ahead and stick to my, you know, my sweet spot, my one meal for today. So, um, yeah, where are the guys? Girl, they're at Braylon's basketball practice. So I actually have their dinner going in there right now. So they'll be eating um, pork chops. I'm making some rice and some green beans, you know, for the family. So that's what they'll be eating. So, um, yeah, girl. Oh, yeah. And I did finish my water for the day. So kudos to me, pat myself on the back. I just finished up um, because remember earlier I was telling you, girl, your nephew was keeping me uh, in line. Okay, so I um, only had about 30 more ounces to go. So I just finished that off with dinner. So um, doing good with my water. Now I'll say, of course, I'll be back to show you my steps, but you already know those steps will be down. Um, but remember, girl, we're not really, you know, concentrating on the number per se you know we just showing up for ourselves every single morning doing the workout so what am I going to do for the rest of the night girl I'm about to chill out okay because when I tell you this has been a week okay girl listen I am so happy that I do not have to go to the office tomorrow no hospital no office no anything so just like I was saying earlier girl Listen, I'm going to enjoy the day. So my weekend has officially started. So I'm going to chill out for the rest of the night. Maybe watch a little TV. You already know. Probably watch my football. Now, of course, I'll do my usual. I have to get my workout clothes for in the morning. Because like I always say, girl, I don't have time to be fumbling around at 4 o'clock in the morning, you know, trying to get workout clothes together. So that's going to be it. So here in the next little bit, I'll finish, you know, fixing my um, the dinner for the family. I'll get myself ready for the night. Go through my nighttime routine and we're gonna call it a night girl so listen of course i hope you've had the most amazing day girl i'll just be jet i'll just be back to show you my steps I have had the most amazing day from doing the things I enjoy to eating the foods I love. Go ahead in the comments, tell me one thing that has made your day amazing. Y'all already know what to do. Show your girls some love. Click the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a video from me. I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.